time once again for a new their reaction video. All through the summer, I've been streaming the Telltale game series Sam and Max, and I'm about to uh, finish that whole series up by playing the season finale, the very last game. Uh, but before I did that, I want to take a quick look and just uh, react back at some of the clips of the previous games and just revel in the nostalgia of that six foot tall dog and that hyperkinetic gravity thing. Your magnetism is a cute bedtime story, but I believe in one thing. Okay, fine. I guess I can believe in two things, but that's my lip. Them. 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 Don't break the rule of peace. A mug, just eat a brimstone sandwich in peace. Ah, uh, brimstone. I will feast on your entrails and devour your soul. Stop playing with the escalator. No. Oh, 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 my God, I'm on fire! Congratulations, you exist. Nice try, but I don't believe in you either. Start crying or I'm gonna dip you in honey barbecue sauce and throw you to a polar bear. Oh, goody, I love polar bears. Don't you get it? A polar bear would chop your head off. What? Nothing that cute could be dangerous. Ouch. I didn't think I still had feelings, but there they are. Can you explain something to us? There is no question you could have that I could not answer immediately. Shoot. Metaphorically. Aww. Max chatting with the former president before violently decapitating. Eliminate him. You are my idol! I didn't. Hey, Max, want to see how I won all those surfing trophies back in school? No, I don't want to see you cry to the PE teacher and then beg me to club your competitors in the knees. Why? Out of hell fire! <laughs> yep, we have to get into that cave. Beat it! We'll give you a nice big rattle for that dumb old gun of yours. You two are seriously trying my patience. Sam, let's teach him the wrong words for things. As I was saying, there's another case solved, and with minimal casualties. You can't close the store, Bosco. Everything we value was bought or shoplifted from here. Next time you hear from him, tell Grandpa Stinky we said hello. Oh, I don't think we'll be hearing from him ever again. Sam and Max, the demon didn't get us. Oh. Why won't you guys just die? What's he gonna do? Give him the silent treatment? No! Stop! Please! Hey, past me! Check this out! Shake that thing! You mean... But I, I, I thought... But I thought... Huh? What? No! I quit! I'm gonna be a dentist! <laughs> I wonder why they call this the Flounder Pounder. Sam last year. And that's why we no longer have secret Santa at the office. Hmm. It looks like... Say it? It looks like Bosco's as clever as you are at cutting-edge intellectual humor. <laughs> uh, how do you get the DNA samples? Isn't that obvious? Huh? Max doesn't even like girls. They're a nuisance at best. Hasn't been interested since... Well, when did that start exactly? I think it all goes back to that time we were... No flashback? Mm, okay. Well, it's been ever since junior high. Max is belligerent, <laughs> recalcitrant, and quite possibly psychotic. So you're jealous, is that it? Want to keep him all to yourself? I never knew you felt this way, Sam. Temporal anomaly detect- Shut up! It's not like that. What a waste. What a senseless waste. Spilt milk. What have you two been doing all this time? Hanging out with your mom. Hey, Chan, what are you working on? <laughs> I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. 
But we're strangers who have candy and cool guns you can play with. Wouldn't you rather grow up to be as cool as I am? With a boss car and a detective job and a huge gun? Hmm, would I have to be as fat as you too? Temporal anomaly detected. You got lucky, punk. I'd like to meet the man who can murder old Stinky. Hi, I'm Max. Are you the parents of those two parasites? Well, not exactly. Although we do still have a time machine, so I wouldn't completely rule out the possibility. That's gross, Max. <laughs> I'm just saying, where do you think this portal goes? Anywhere that's not on a spaceship set to self-destruct and hurtling towards the beginning of the universe. All right, Sam. This doesn't work. I'll see you in hell. So, Sam, is now a good time to start pulling my hair out and wetting myself in panic? Knock yourself out, pal. Better hurry, though. Laugh. <laughs> And we say, nope. What about, nope. What about, Tugger? Yanker? Tool Handler? Hmm. Okay, All right. good. good to know. <laughs> Boss goes naked. I'm doing everything I can not to think about that. On natural. You're not helping. In the raw. I'm not listening. In the bar, in his birthday suit. Shut up! Nude. Max, meet Demon Peepers. Oh, hi! Demon Peepers here says he's my partner and best friend. Hey there! What are you... Oh, God! What the devil? That hell was practically inescapable. Sorry, Satan. Your demon imposter was no match for the true power of friendship and cooperation. Plus, I ripped out his kidneys. Max, distract Mr. Bliss for me. Hmm, I seem to be completely naked. Oh, dear. Hope I don't have to bend over provocatively <laughs> to... That's enough, Max. I hate to say it, but <laughs> Peepers is kind of sexy. <laughs> if you're into short guys with annoying voices, I guess. Hey, Dick Peacock. <laughs> What? What? You ruined everything! What have you done to his eyes? You still want to make out? <laughs> oh, hell no! <laughs> I'm not enjoying the <laughs> poppers anymore. Can I kill them? Not if I get them first. I don't mind, Sam. As long as I'm with my best friend. Oh, that's sweet, little pal. Hey, give me one of those pork rinds you were carrying. Sorry, buddy. I already ate them all. We're gonna die! <laughs> Somebody help! Hello, Commissioner. No, Sam's here. I don't know. He just let me answer it. Hey, boss. Oh, dear God. Hey, Jimmy. Wanna touch my unicorn? Need it. No, just touch it. Bam! Okay, that's quite enough of that. Can you believe we get paid for this? I love this country. Hmm. Ooh. That's pretty inconvenient. It's okay, Sam. I can be brave. We'll just have to struggle cheeselessly onward. Do you have any weapons of mass destruction? Who's asking? Seriously, I'm going to have to place you under arrest. How long have you felt these compulsions? It started when we found the lady in your closet. Prepare yourself for my hypnotic dance of the third degree. <laughs> On every planet I visit, all of the local mole people are invited to ride my fantastic gamma beam to a wonderful off-world vacation they'll never forget. I don't kill them. Prune nut. <laughs> Sorry, I was thinking about something else. The White House. White House, Agent Super Bowl speaking. Have you checked the baby? Yes, sir, sleeping soundly. Oh, good job then. <laughs> Super Bowl? Yeah, that's a negative on the access permission, sir. I'll have to ask you and your little friend to step away from the White House. Doggy Daddy, this is Loose Cannon. Request permission to pants this goon. Over. Hey, Sam, did I ever mention how I've memorized pi to 1,000 decimal places? It's 3.14159265358979. Do you have a piece of paper handy? You want to write down the phone number? 
I remember the number. I want to write myself a reminder to smother you with a pillow in your sleep. You got ten grand. I'm new at this. I have a lot of student loans. Great! Loan us a student! I can ride it around like a pony! It's nice to see you show such enthusiasm. Security. Suddenly, a tiny Kandiru fish swims up the Pope's and lodges itself in his Arthur grabs the Pope's pliers and swelled up like a melon. And the Pope says, thanks! Last time that happened, McKinley wanted to Oh. No, wait, wait, wait. I think I told it wrong. 